success is not final failure is not fatal success is not final failure is not fatal it is the courage to continue that counts a very good morning to one and all on this note i welcome you all on behalf of institutions innovation council to the webinar on how to build a successful startup by dr n nirmala devi associate professor department of mike biochemistry sri narayana guru college coimbatore Now I call upon Mr. Selva Jayanti, IIT convener, Assistant Professor, Department of Microbiology, to welcome the gathering. Good morning, everyone. I'm glad to welcome to the virtual gathering on how to build a successful startup session. My hearty welcome to Dr. Nirmala Devi N, Associate Professor, Department of Biochemistry, Sri Narayana Guru College, Coimbatore. She is our eminent speaker today. Thank you for accepting our invitation, ma'am. She is a knowledgeable person who will educate us on how to start a successful startups. Please accept my heartfelt greetings, ma'am. It's my pleasure to convey a warm welcome to our principal, Dr. B. Subramani, who has been instrumental in supporting all the events. Mm -hmm. I would like to greet all the instructors and the students who are taking part in this event. I would like to wish everyone have a happy and joyful learning. Thank you all. It's my pleasure to extend to introduce our chief guest. Dr. N. Nirmala Devi, Department of Biochemistry, Sri Narayana Guru College, Coimbatore. She is an innovative and knowledgeable professional with excellent academic records, and she is having 17 years of teaching experience. started as assistant professor and promoted as associate professor in the year 2019 she is immense knowledgeable in developing new lessons and activities <coughs> she is having the ability to connect with the students and respond to their needs and motivate them to for their best she is an extensive participant in the committees and the clubs she is in charge for nac and iso interdisciplinary coverage of the theoretical and practical aspects She is well versed with traditional and modern teaching methods and equipments. She has done his UG, PG, MPhil, and PhD in PLG College of Arts and Science. She achieved first rank holder in the year 2004 by MSc Biochemistry, and she has qualified set for the lectureship in the Life Science in the year 2006. and she, she has received funded project from the management of uh, narayana guru college and she has carried out many projects and published more than 17 papers in national and international reputed journals and have participated in many seminars and workshops and conferences she has acted as a eminent speaker in many seminars and webinars she is a social activist Thank you, ma'am. Now the forum is yours. Thank you, ma'am, for uh, such a wonderful introduction. Um, before uh, starting into the session, uh, I would like to thank our management principal and uh, my own faculty members uh, for uh, uh, helping helping me to give this webinar. And I am uh, really thankful to the management principal. and uh, iiz coordinator uh, ms selva jayanti department of microbiology uh, shri neeru mahavidyalaya 
uh, for giving me this opportunity uh, to give a webinar to enlighten the students on uh, uh, the current uh, topic of startup. I would like to thank Dr. Uh, Vinod Kumar sir, uh, who has introduced me to Selva Jainthi ma'am for uh, this webinar. So shall I start the session now? Yes, ma'am. Yes. I'm sharing the screen, ma'am. So uh, today we are uh, in the current uh, trendy topic, uh, I used to say, like uh, how to build a successful startup. So we, in our day-to-day uh, -day life, we have seen many people who have been successful in business, but the successful, uh, uh, the meaning of successful lies in the uh, core of a startup or what you call it as a business. So the core in the sense idea. So a new, every new startup or every new uh, business which you are uh, looking now, they have brought a core idea which established and uh, the idea which has been established and uh, kept in a line for the success. So we are going to learn few of the uh, points here to build a successful startup. So how we are going to build a successful startup and uh, what are the necessary things to find out wh what is important for a startup. So coming to the first slide, uh, I have only one question. So which is the basic question for starting a startup. So why are you interested in entrepreneurship? So only the people who are really interested in an entrepreneurship will go out, uh, will be having the quest for searching an idea for a startup. So when you want to really, uh, after completing your UG or a PG degree, when you want to go into a, a business, you need to have some interest. We need to have a passion. So each and every one, they cannot step into a successful entrepreneurship. So my question is, why are you interested in entrepreneurship? So the answer may be, the first one is, you have an idea. So you have an idea that could change the whole world. When you are going to execute in a process, the, I, the idea is going to help, the, help to change the whole world. So the first entrepreneurial requirement is you have an idea. So that is the basic of what I told you is uh, for a startup. And the next one is you have a technological breakthrough. So you are very sound in technology and you have an idea, you can combine it with your technology and then you need to invest in that uh, idea and you are going to bring out certain fruitful things which will help yourself as well as the society. So whenever uh, we have to keep in mind that whenever we are going in for a business or an entrepreneurship, when you want to give a startup, we will have to uh, we will have to think divergent we are not going to have one uh, single focused thing so there are many questions which we will have to answer we have to ask questions to ourselves we have to find out an answer and then we will have to go ahead with the idea so the first thing is idea and the second one is you have a technological breakthrough and you want to capitalize it so you want to make money out of it so ultimately, when you want to become a businessman, it is only uh, commercialization, right? So we need to commercialize our product. We need to get, we need to earn money out of it. So when you want to earn money, we need to have a better idea. So that idea is going to help, up, help our startup. And the third one is the most important thing that is passion. So that is why the question is, why are you interested in entrepreneurship? So only when you are interested, only when you have a quest for uh, going in for an entrepreneurship, only when you have a passion for an entrepreneurship, then you can uh, go in for a startup business. So the third point, even if it is a third uh, criteria, we, uh, we think that it is uh, more important, passion and uh, learning. So again and again, we need to learn, we need to look out uh, for different ideas and uh, for the 
uh, technology which would be combined to which will make our idea even more better to reach the customers so these are the three things when you want to become an entrepreneur you will have to uh, keep in your mind so uh, i have a technological breakthrough i have an idea i have a passion any one of these will uh, give you a better startup idea and to be successful in your entrepreneurship okay and uh, the next thing is what is a startup so so far we have seen what is an entrepreneurship so now we will have to go with what is startup everybody are telling uh, we need to have a startup business startup and what do you mean by startup it is nothing but a business your own business and you are wishing to work for the business in your own company you are going to work and you are going to give uh, you are going to put uh, your uh, effort into your company and you are going to make uh, you are going to get Uh, or uh, you can better put it in a way like you are going to commercialize it and you are going to take a benefit out of the business so it, there is a definition which was given by uh, graham like a startup is company designed to grow fast so you have a basic idea and you are going to develop the idea and it is going to grow into a multinational company and you are going to uh, get benefits out of it so they these are nothing but uh, young companies so as the name suggests uh, startup is nothing but an young company where you have a unique idea what do you mean by unique idea it is an entirely different idea the idea here you are not going to uh, you are not going to take an idea from the existing companies you are going to make your own idea you are going to create your own idea and you are going to convert that idea into a product or a service and then you are going to put it in the market and then you are going to satisfy the customers with that unique idea then you will be entering into what is called as a successful entrepreneur so to become a successful entrepreneur uh business the main thing is your startup so it is an initial business so here you need to note one particular point what is called as a unique idea so the idea should be entirely different uh, only then you can sustain in your uh, market okay so that you call it as an innovation so innovation is nothing but finding out a new idea so when you have an innovative idea what will you get there is an invention and commercialization so when there is an innovation which is nothing but equal to invention and commercialization which means you are going to invent a new product and then out of the new product you are going to uh, commercialize it and you are going to get benefit out of it so you have to uh, have a basic idea so uh, when you go into the successful stories of many of the entrepreneurs in india or in abroad the whole world you have got uh, so many entrepreneurs Uh, when you just go and learn their history you would uh, you could you can see that the path traveled by these entrepreneurs they are not they are not successful they are not uh, uh, to be uh, very specific it is not smooth you will be having many ups and downs what we call it as challenges so uh, how uh, there are many challenges we will have to face when you bring out a startup because it is a unique idea you do not know how the idea is going to work out so there are multiple challenges so what are the challenges which are faced by the startup so when you are going to build a startup you will be having uh, to identify the advantages and disadvantages of the startup and the second thing is right team to help you so only the idea will not uh, be sufficient so other than the idea you will have to need a perfect team it is a team work business it is not a, a, a single person you cannot run the whole business you need a right team to organize it and to take it to the next level so we will have to build a right team and of course funding is a uh,
this uh, new and whether it can be executed in the market what is the uh, status of uh, the market uh, market and what is the uh, what is the overall thinking of the customers regarding that particular idea will the customers be happy when you are introducing or when you are converting this idea into a product ultimate aim is to satisfy the customer so we will have to learn uh, the market uh, strategies and then uh, about the users users in the sense customers so what is the great starting point so here we have so many criteria which are listed out for a startup and uh, which is going to play an important role so that starting point is nothing but a great great idea so why i am repeating it as idea in the sense without an going for the startup and here if you see even uh, in this group each and every one will be having an idea so idea doesn't mean that it should be a great so even if it is a small smaller thing Uh, it is it is good when you go when you learn the application so everyone uh, has ideas and the ideas will also be great okay it may be a great idea so the, we have to find out that particular idea and then we will have to go in with the startup company so if you want to become an entrepreneur so when you want to become an entrepreneur if it is an s then you need to take up an idea and then you will have to go up with the startup company so why i am sticking on to this idea because uh, for those people who have not uh, got a background of business so there are many people who will be having at least a small business family business which is running and uh, you will be entering into that particular business and you will promote it so the people who are not having an idea of how to start a business it will be uh, like a tough task so getting a unique idea it may be a tough task because uh, you see if you want to become a, uh, if you want to uh, own a grocery company you already have it in your market so if you want to uh, build a website you already uh, if you want to build an app if you want to find out something new uh, you have it already in the market so in the market in the sense you will have to study what are the ideas which are present in the market and how you could uh, how you could uh, develop how you could be different from that particular idea which is already existing in the market so why i am telling you uh, this is 71 percentage of the business as per uh, the survey it tell, uh, tells that it fails within 10 years so they start a business and the business is really unique they think that it is a great idea of starting a business and uh, they implement it so i told you there are few points which we will have to take care so uh, if you are going to put uh, an idea into a business and if you fail in any one of the points slowly drastically you will be seeing a failure in your business so 71 percentage of the business fail within 10 years because the idea is not unique or they would have failed in some part of the uh, criteria so why i am telling you that a startup company is not easy because it it requires a hard work so you need to work hard prior when you are starting the business and after the business has been started hard work 24 into 7 we will have to work hard you will have to be dedicated because it is as i told you it is your own business you are going to work in your own company you have a passion to work in your own company so we will have to be dedicated and then we will have to why we are starting a business ultimately we have to earn money so when you need money both this hard work and dedication will help you to earn more amount of money and some sleepless nights why some sleepless because uh your business when you are uh, into the business and you are uh, working hard and you are really dedicated you will be setting a standard so till setting a standard we will have to uh, have some sleepless nights we have to work and rework and rework on certain aspects and then we will have to uh, 
uh, going with the success in your business so once you want your startup to be really successful these are the important points which you will have to keep in mind whether it is a pre startup or uh, you are going to start a you have started a business and you want to find out uh, what, uh, you have to sit learn how my business is going on you will have to note down the points you have to carry a notebook you have to note the point so where i am so uh, only then you will be having a success so each and every year we will have to set a mark we will have to cross the mark that is the success story of each and every businessman even even now so the main startup reality is most of the startups fail okay so why i told you the failure is because uh, once they start the business they think that okay my business is really good i need not uh, i need not go to the office it is already given to a team member uh, he or she will look after it so many people uh, think like that when once they reach a particular point so that you will have to avoid and there are five essential elements to start a successful startup the first one is your idea so your idea is important then you have team and execution as i told you you need a perfect team to execute your idea you may be well versed in the idea but uh, uh, there are few people who are not sound in the uh, it so we need a technical backup a, a team for executing the uh, it it work and the money so how you are going to make money out of this idea that is a business model how you are going to uh, develop your business funding of course funding is really important as i told you it is a fuel of the engine and timing so when you are starting a business you will have to ask a question why this startup and do the startup necessary at this particular time and will it be will it be okay in the forthcoming years so the timing is really important right business at a wrong time will not give you a fruitful result so uh, during the pandemic situation you you would have experienced that there are really more startup business which were oriented towards the uh, uh, what do you tell uh, uh, internet internet oriented uh, courses apps so you have got so many learning apps which has been uh, uh, success in these pandemic situations right so the right timing is really important for your business so now the uh, topic like uh, how to develop a great startup idea so every, every uh, each and every slide i am telling you get a startup idea where to get it how to get it so this is a tricky uh, question and a topic because i told you the idea should be unique and we need to have a great idea unique idea great idea and how we are going to get this idea so that is a question so first we will for this first we will have to learn the startups which have failed so only when you learn the success and the failure of certain startups you will know how to find out an idea so here i have given you few examples uh, of startups which failed so there is there was a friendster friendster it is like your uh, instagram and facebook which you use now so this uh, uh, this failed because Uh, it had certain site issues so they were concept initially uh, the friendster it was uh, started with uh, 10 people uh, 10 uh, people who connected with each other and they started to play games and share their experiences and later uh, it got uh, it got used up and more and more people started to use this as you use your instagram and facebook now and they they failed to concentrate on the performance issues because as and as and when you get more and more customers uh, you will have to see that you are going to accommodate so many of them so the website had a massive traffic which could not which was not solved by this particular uh, company and uh, rising competition so when you think that uh, you have an idea and there is uh, one more person 
uh, who will develop this idea so if you take in the case of what whatsapp uh, facebook and instagram they get the basic idea from what what is called as friendster and uh, they they have incorporated many things into the uh, application and they see that the, uh, may, as many members they come you are not getting uh, you are you are uh, accommodated inside the application so uh, that that was uh, that was the reason for the failure here and one more failure startup failure is cosmocom so they struggled to find out investors so it was a company uh, which uh, which so which was which was selling groceries and uh, uh, they uh, i told you funding is also important we need to find out uh, sir, uh, people who who would really uh, know what kind of uh, business we are doing and they will have to invest in our business so initially they told that Well, within within our hour of delivery, they will be giving the groceries, and it was a free delivery. And later, they could not make up with the free delivery, and they charged for the uh, delivery, and they started uh, to find uh, uh, certain um, uh, messy things, and they could not uh, 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 they could not uh, meet out the customers. They could not satisfy the customers. so they uh, they really had a uh, failure in that particular uh, area and you have got webvan so webvan uh, is a business model uh, which uh, had an aggressive expansion in the sense see first when you are going to have a startup uh, we need to have in a small uh, we need to implement the business in a very small area we will have to learn the uh, learn the responses only then we will have to go with the multiple branches but webvan within a shorter period period of time they started to have a expansion they opened multiple stores and uh, they they could not uh, find uh, they could not connect they could not find out what is happening in all the stores so they could not collect the data they could not uh, deliver the material in a uh, in uh, uh, in the particular time as they have promised to the customers so these are the certain reasons for the failure and these are few examples which i want to give you so when you are going to start a business we need to know uh, what would cause a startup a failure one so only when you learn that you could, you can find out a solution for that problem and then you can uh, succeed in your startup business so what makes a startup succeed you need not bother about the ratings because it was uh, uh, it was given out uh, by some survey but these are few startup companies when you compare with the previous one uh, you could really understand uh, these successful companies uh, how they have learned the problem and they have solved they have find out a solution and they have solved it so instagram so i already told you the friendster they could not uh, ha handle the massive traffic uh, which was uh, in their application but instagram they wisely solved all those problems and they accommodated they had many uh, new uh, applications which uh, which were included and uh, they they are now uh, successfully running the business a smaller idea which have turned into a uh, a successful business and you have got uber and uh, uh, you can have uh, many other examples also which uh, uh, have uh, succeeded in the country uh, uber it is one of the taxi right so uh, they they found out uh, they found out the core problem which existed in the population so they saw that Uh, people are uh, finding very difficult to reach from one particular place to another particular place uh, so they wanted to make uh, certain uh, they wanted to pick up an idea of uh, uh, satisfying the people okay they want to take the people from one place to another place within a stipulated time with uh, all sorts of uh, sophisticated uh, vehicle so uh, they succeeded and they are still now in the platform with success 
and uh, now if you see we have seen few examples of how startup uh, failed and what helped uh, certain uh, startups to succeed so you cannot determine the idea which you are having will really be successful so you may have an idea you may also have written the problems the idea would face and you would also have been uh, for, uh, you would also have found a solution for the problem but when you are implementing it you will be having an entirely different environment so nobody knows that a startup idea will be successful so what are the common mistakes we are doing to find out an idea when it is a startup idea what is the common mistake we do need an amazing idea so when you want to start a business you think you you uh, you learn only uh, uh, for example if you take uh, reliance or uh, uh, if you take uh, zomato or swiggy you are looking into the file uh, you are looking into the uh, stage where these people have uh, expanded their business so we are not uh, looking into the basic uh, level of idea what would have created zomato to start a, such a business so we think that we need really we need a amazing idea to make a business that is the first mistake we do and the next mistake is jumping into the first idea so immediately okay i want to start a business you start it immediately without learning the consequences without knowing the advantages and disadvantages so both are extreme ends getting an amazing idea jumping into the first idea both are extreme ends and both will will not give you a successful startup so if you want to really going for a successful startup you will have to spend years before starting it sort out work work it work on it where you are going to start why you are going to start and uh, what will be the what what is the necessity for starting a business without knowing the necessity if you start a business it will be of course it will not give you a turnover right so when you want to start up a successful idea you will have to spend years work on it okay and uh, only when you work you will be getting into a successful business and the third mistake is to start with a solution instead of a problem see you will have to find out the problem only then you will have to find a solution only when there is a problem we'll go in for the solution right so normally if you uh, um, if you just note in every day in every day each and every day we have a problem and unknowingly we are finding out a solution so that is the spark so that uh, identification of the problem is really important to find out a solution so without uh, knowing the problem if you are going in for the solution then you will not be ending up with a successful business idea so there is one example which i have given so you are going to imagine that you have got a superb uh, startup idea uber for plumbers so you have created created a massive uh, you have created a wonderful website and uh, uh, you have uh, you are uh, technically very sound and you have got certain uh, 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 numbers and uh, people uh, for uh, plumbing and you know you without knowing the problem what you are going to do you are going to uh, start an idea and if you push a button a plumber shows up and this is a solution what problem it is going to solve so what is the problem so uh, in our each and every uh, house you are having a house or whatever it is a company or a college or a school wherever you have uh, the plumbing activity which is done you need plumbers to rectify uh, to uh, rectify the problem so unless and otherwise you have a space for registering the people who are having the problem you will not get a solution so ultimate aim is to use the plumbers for the repairing activity so when the problem is not properly identified you cannot uh, even even if you find out a solution it is of no use so you need to have a problem 
and you need to find out a solution and you need to have a methodology in how the problem is being solved and the last uh, mistake which we do is startup ideas are hard to find so either you you think that you need a great idea or immediately when you get an idea you jump into the idea convert it into a business or you just go directly into the solution rather than finding out the problem or you have you think that it is very hard to find out an idea business oh i cannot do the business it needs uh, more and more uh, uh, knowledge no it is not like that a startup ideas are really easy to find so how you are going to find out the startup idea see you have many real problems that are left in the world so if you, there are many problems in the world which still that that needs a solution for that particular problem the only thing is we will have to identify the real problem which is existing in the world and uh, a solution for that problem so how you find out a problem keep a problem journal so what do you what do you mean by this always have a notebook with you and whenever you think that uh, you uh, have a problem you just make a note of it so it may be crazy idea but it would surely help you to get a start see i hate scraping my windows i hate sweeping i hate waiting for taxis i can't pay rent i i hate hotels so these are the problems real problems and these problems were effectively used by many of the companies and they are now uh, successful entrepreneurs i hate sweeping find out a find out a, a machine find out a, a material which would help you to sweep so you have it i hate waiting for taxis you have an application o o a o l a you have uber you have right there are so many taxis uh, nowadays so i can't pay rent you have paytm so uh, that that was a smaller a real problem that was a very small problem you need to wait for hours together to pay the bills so now if you have a smartphone in your hand you can pay your rent you hate hotels you can uh, have a, a traditional uh, home uh, you can book a room right so these are the sp small problems these are everyday problems you 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 i want you people to note that it is an everyday problem each and every person come across and uh, these problems are solved by certain companies and i want each and every one of you to note down the problem only when you note down the problem you will be getting an idea of how to get a solution so this is all because of only one good idea which you get and the, these are the few problems which i want to give you so you look into the environment you have many problems i have given you only one kind of pollution here oil pollution you can uh, you can develop a business you can develop a startup company you can develop uh, uh, if uh, there are many i think biotech and microbiology students here so you can uh, you can develop a bead nano bead which could uh, remove this oil spill and uh, you have a land pollution you can help in sorting out the waste you can help in sorting out the waste right and you can also help uh, you can also develop an idea to uh recycle the waste so that will that will also be uh, be a good idea for a startup and uh, in case of uh, medical emergencies now you have uh, ph pharma pharmacy right at your doorstep right so uh, you have the you even you order you get the pills you get your medicines right at the doorstep so these are the few problems which you come across Uh, i want uh, each and every one of you to find out such kind of a problem and how you are going to find out the solution so these are certain solutions so how you are making how you are going to make the work easy so that is the startup idea so as i told you uh, you can uh, segregate the waste and the waste can be used in a proper way you can recycle the waste into a useful product and you have gadgets 
so you can uh, uh, you can design a gadget which will help the people right you can uh, help your help the physically handicapped you can find you can find out a new uh, 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 gadget which would be helpful for the physically handicapped for the kitchen for uh, for the hospitals for the environment In any kind of problem will be having a solution the thing is we have to identify the problem so identification of the problem will give you an idea so try to solve every day problem so one good example uh, i told you i cannot scrap the window so uh, there are, there is a country there is a place called wisconsin they call it as a frozen region because uh, in the middle of the winter if you see the country is uh, during the winter season okay uh, there will be a, a pile of snows so here in this particular place there was about 8 inches of snow and when you warm up the car you can de ice the windshield and then you will have to scrap up the ice it will when you want to go to the office when you are staying in this particular place and when you want to go for the work it will really take half an hour to deice the ice which is present on the windshield and then you will have to scrap up the ice clean up everything and then you will have to go so this uh, thinking this uh, the people uh, the people uh, each and every day they were doing uh, this as a routine work before they start to go to their work but uh, a particular person had an idea why not we have a material which would be put on the window of the car or uh, a vehicle and as soon as uh, morning you when you want to go to work just pull the sheet you can deice you need not uh, warm up the car for deicing process and then scrap the remaining ice instead a sheet uh, we call uh, we call it as uh, wind sheet right so we, uh, on the windshield if you just put a sheet you can remove the sheet and you can get rid of the snow so this was the real problem and the problem uh, the solution was also in the hand but the thing is the particular person who thought of this did not build a protocol to execute it so he or she knows the problem he or she knows the solution but the third mistake what that particular person did is they never had a, a protocol for that solution so that protocol if you really executed uh, it would cost cost around only 50 dollars for that particular sheet and uh, you would have uh, become uh, he or she would have become a, a great entrepreneur so that that was the real problem and real solution that was a day every day problem so when you want to find when you find out the problem you should also be passionate so now that you have an idea so idea should no as i told you uh, you need not get it from the external environment you first analyze yourself and find out uh, in which field you are really passionate you may be an arts graduate or a science graduate but you may be interested in some other thing so we will have to find out in which field we are really passionate and then we will have to go uh, pick up an idea from that passion and then you will have to build up a protocol for the successful ideas okay so now we have a uh, few companies uh, here microsoft facebook uh, you have instagram amazon there are so many companies and why did microsoft and these companies win and still they are existing in the market it is because earlier in the traditional method we have been comfortable so we all the time we have been writing and writing and writing uh, we we have been creating ledgers notes everything we did manually so these people they had a unique idea why why don't we change this traditional method and why don't we make this easy even more easy the same writing part which could be done on a uh, system so it could be then it was like why don't we uh, create a platform to share it from one particular person to another particular person so uh, ideas come from one particular 
root so find out the root cause and then you have to build the ideas so uh, before people were comfortable but after these companies they started to uh, give out more and more sophisticated environment working on a computer it made even more easy life easier so one particular idea it changed the whole world and now without a system without a mobile phone without uh, certain apps nobody can nobody can uh, move forward so that that was the uh, one particular idea which changed the whole world and uh, funding so i am not going to talk much on funding uh, because we are uh, more emphasized on how to uh, get an idea so i i uh, uh, give a few uh, points on funding so funding initial funding obviously it is from your friends and family who will be supporting you and uh, that is called as bootstrapping and then uh, you can have uh, when your business is into the next level you can have some investors who are really interested in your business and want to invest in your business and then you can have uh, uh, companies million you can earn million dollars uh, uh, into companies and then uh, at the final stage uh, it, uh, your product can uh, you can put it into a public company okay but the basic thing is we need funding without funding you cannot get into the uh, successful business you cannot promote your business to the next level and along with the funding you also need to go with the business loss so legal legal uh, uh, path we will have to make it right so what kind of business license we will have to get and uh, what are, what are the legal structures and is there any permission you need to get it from uh, from the uh, uh, companies from the government and is there any inspection there are certain food uh, food and quality uh, if you are going to have an idea of starting anything which is related to uh, food industries and leather you will have to go with the uh, inspections so then you need to go with the sales tax license and uh, whether you are going for online business alone or you are going to plan it for an offline business and how you are going to uh, get the contractors or you are going to get the employees in what way in what uh, what would be the right strategy for getting the employees and uh, when you are appointing certain employees again we need, we have uh, laws which would uh, uh, which we will have to abide by and uh, simultaneously we will have to create a website so online and offline both are important for a business uh, create a beautiful website and uh, you know when you open a particular uh, website uh, there are certain websites you get attracted towards because uh, they are really beautiful they have beautiful pictures in them okay and it is easy to operate also so you need to have a strong e-commerce platform which would help you to sell your business online and offline as well as offline it should be because customer there are few customers uh, even if you sell your products in online they will be eager to shop it on offline so they will be coming into your shop the shop uh, you will have to see that uh, the shops are also planned in such a way that it is attracting the customers and then grow your business so how we are going to grow your business advertisement social media influencer marketing send your products to the celebrities nowadays celebrities who whatever may be the product if a celebrity is coming on uh, coming uh, with the with your product it would be a success right at least uh, people will uh, see what kind of product it is facebook groups google advertising content marketing word of mouth in the sense uh, if a customer is really happy with your product uh, they will pass the message to the uh, to uh, other people so that is word of mouth youtube videos update your youtube videos okay so so only when you learn grow your business you can uh, earn money out of it so uh, when you want to uh, have a real startup you will have to learn learn and learn you have to do a lot of research you have to learn the market you have to learn uh, 
the problem and you need to learn the customers and you should not forget that we need to learn about our competitors so there are few competitors which will uh, uh, which will find out who will find out the root of your business and they will have an entirely different idea in that and they will develop so we will have to uh, we will we will have to be vigilant that is why i told you sleepless nights so we will be we will be having uh, the path is not smooth you will be having hurdles we will have to work work and rework and rework on it to have a successful idea and uh, the most important thing is we will have to uh, read the books magazines articles related to business update yourself uh, daily each and every day you will have to update only then you will have to only then you can uh, have a uh, uh, have a idea of how you can develop your business so get the feedback from the people from the family from the friends and the local customers so get the feedback continuously each and every uh, feedback will help you will give you an uh, uh, um, point for developing your business so feedback is really important okay there are a few startup ideas uh, which i would like to uh, um, tell the students so you can have a eco friendly healthy environment healthy uh makeup and beauty products uh, you can uh, become an educational uh, uh, content writer ebook writer resume writer when you are really interested when you have passion on uh, writing you can go with that when you are uh, uh, when you want uh, to make your work easy you can go with the making of smart appliances when you are really interested in exploring new places you can uh, become a local guide zero waste products plant based products there are many people who are coming from the agricultural background i have few examples after this which i will finish it off within 2 uh, or 3 minutes so agricultural background you don't think that agriculture is a next level so don't think that it is uh, not going to help you it will really help you the only thing is get a uh, get a spark get an idea how how to develop your uh, agriculture and you can uh, when you are interested in fashion designing you can create custom clothing you can uh, uh, you can uh, uh, make products okay you can uh, there are many people who are really having a real time problem for the uh, there are a few there are many people who go to work and they do not have uh, they do not have uh, right person to take care of the kids and the all members of the family so you can uh, Uh, you can find out uh, find out a place you can hire people who could uh, really take care of uh, these people make product for pets you can reinvent exercising you can become a online coach and uh, you can start up a restaurant food truck which which move from one particular place to another place mobile restaurants so uh, metal preparations Uh, which would help the physically handicapped and uh, make uh, daily work easy so uh, apart from this you can also have any business ideas these are few business ideas which uh, i want to uh, tell the students and there are few successful startups in india i have given a uh, few examples here paytm as we were discussing uh, uh, that i cannot pay my rent i cannot pay my i couldn't pay my uh, uh, bills at the proper time so they they ha- they came with the they identified the problem they came with the solution so paytm by juice learning app ole ole right uh, rooms you can now book your rooms right from your place swiggy and zomato uh, nike for beauty and passion lens cart right big basket delivery so they they deliver the goods uh are very promptly they are very very prompt they within uh, the stipulated uh, time which they have given you can also track uh, uh, uh the conditions you can also um, verify how far your uh, goods are being approved so these are the uh, startups in india which are really successful because they identified the real problem and they found out the solution and uh, 
few uh, examples uh, in india who had uh, made uh, a smaller uh, startup idea and uh, they have really grown into a such a wonderful uh, business amul so they started with the, they started to help the poor dairy farmers so that was a small uh, um, idea to help the poor farmers and uh, they were only helping the farmers to supply the milk from uh, one place to another place and later they started to design what is called as uh, amul so they they uh, they uh, they formulated more and more products they created more and more only only the uh, only uh, the transportation of milk uh, will not help you to survive in the industry so they identified they worked on it and they found out that we could also prepare uh, many items out of the milk and they they eventually they had a, a growth and uh, and they have a successful entrepreneur now and uh, this is one more example a coimbatore based uh, kirai kadai uh, he is from an agricultural background and uh, uh, he started uh, his main aim was to his main aim was to uh, get fresh green leafy vegetables and uh, he was uh, supplying these green leafy vegetables only to the nearby apartments so later he identified that uh, people don't have time to uh, uh, use these green leafy vegetables so they are they are uh, much on the instant products so he found out what is called as greeny dip with moringa you call it as murungai and uh, now uh, he has many products in his line like a uh, spinach noodles spinach cookies and jam and he have, he has apart from this farm he also he is also getting the Uh, he is also involving more and more farmers into the uh, business so that that was a small uh, smaller idea only when you uh, put some effort in starting a business from the business you will be getting more and more ideas and then you can uh, build a startup which is really successful and milky mist funny again one uh, good example in uh, e road point to and uh, he he was also began he began his career by supplying the milk and now if you see uh, he has expands he, he has an aggressive expansion of his uh, uh, of his um, uh, products and he has multiple products as well so these are the few startups successful startups in and around so we are uh, we, we really miss Uh, the startup business which are started in and around uh, our own area so we look into only the uh, uh, microsoft and uh, uh, companies uh, worldwide you will reach worldwide the only thing is we will have to first uh, identify the real problem which is around you try to solve it it will become a very good business so this is the overall summary of what we have uh, learned today so you have enough knowledge so each and every one have knowledge so the knowledge doesn't mean that you need to have a subject knowledge apart from that the knowledge is wide so you can have any kind of knowledge but the only thing is we will have to uh, identify uh, in which area we are specify uh, we are uh, super and we will have to bring into the action so you will have to come out of the ordinary so what do you mean by that uh, bring out an idea so uh, you, one once you are going along with the group you will be always in the group and you will not have uh, courage to come out so come out uh, come out of the ordinary you will have to be uh, different when you think different which means that you have a beautiful uh, concept which you can execute and when you execute that particular concept you will success ahead this uh, overall uh, team is not alone for business it is for whatever you are uh, going to plan ahead so with this uh, i'll be uh, uh, completing uh, my webinar on startup i hope uh, you have uh, 
uh, got an idea of how to build a startup out of these uh, few points which i have given you if there is any question you can ask me So children if you have any question you can ask me regarding the startup ma'am how they can approach for funding ma'am ma'am funding uh, there are uh, initially to start a business if uh, the family and friends if they are not if uh, they are helping it is okay or we have uh, banks uh, which uh, Uh, through which they can approach uh, they can uh, get enough funding from the banks so loan facilities are available the only thing is we will have to uh, we will have to uh, uh, we will have to give a description on what we are going to start and uh, how far uh, we would be successful so uh, we need to give a description on what uh, business we are going to start and we can approach there are so many banks which are uh, giving uh, uh, fund, funds for the startups nowadays and there are a few funding agencies as well thank you ma'am thank you thank you for giving us an overview of students with innovative idea can start the startup and the commercialization of the product and customer satisfaction survey how they have to take and market strategies how they have to follow and proper planning and execution will be the success they they should reach the success uh, almost you have covered all the points uh, how to learn from the failures with the real examples and the funding different digital marketing and everything you have covered ma'am with full of energy thank you so much ma'am it's a time to give a vote of thanks now i call upon abhirami from second bsc microbiology to give a vote of thanks good afternoon to one and all present here it is such an honor for me to thank you all dignitaries on behalf of snmb college i would like to express my gratitude to dr nirmala devi associate professor department of microbiology sri narayana guru college coimbatore for taking out her time from her busy schedule for the webinar thank you for encouraging us with your words ma'am a special thanks to dr b subramani principal of snmb college for providing immense support to make the webinar successful I extend my gratitude to Mrs. Selva Jayanti, convener, to organize a webinar. Finally, I thank all my fellow mates for their patient listening. Thank you, everyone, for making it informative and a great success. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you.